<laughs> so George, tell us a little bit about yourself. Okay, I'm a, I'm a law graduate. I studied law in India for You're five years. You're owning your own business. How did that come about? Well, I, I, I should say that it's a passion that I had for a very long time. Okay. Because I, I love cooking and also my mom loves cooking. So that's where I, I gained those attributes from. My mother taught me the, the very basics of cooking since I was young. Then I just progressed slowly from what I knew to perfecting each and everything that I see. Your practice. parents, how do they feel about you starting your own business? Well, actually, they're, uh, they're my number one supporters uh, because they always believe that someone should do something that they have passion for. Mm -hmm. And they never ever pushed me into doing something that they want, so they gave me area to grow. And fortunately, I grew in this culinary world. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so they're very much supportive. Yeah. And tell us a little bit about your restaurant and where um, Nani, what we could find over here. Ah, okay. Uh, actually, uh, it's more of. Uh, you can tell us in Swahili. Nikama <laughs> Nikama uh, uh, Bistro. Na Bistro abda ni seme kuwa sio sio restaurant pase sio bar pase wala pub ni kifanya mbacho kiko katikati. Yeah. Where you, you can get uh, all kinds of beverages, soft drinks, juices, soda, alcohols. You can get very nice food from T-bone to fish skewers to beef skewers and chicken and even duck. Oh wow. Yeah. Oh wow. Mm. I like duck. Yeah, duck is very nice, especially when you know how to cook it. Okay. Yeah. I heard about um, Yamachoma mm. and um, and um, one of your friends actually told me that you do one of the, the best barbecues. Now, Machoma is a barbecue. They do one of the best barbecues. How did you start with also that part of the business and just traveling and catering to other people? Okay. Well, let me just give you a brief, a brief history of where, where I came from with the whole barbecue and stuff. In 2011, I think it was on, on May or something, uh, me and my brother had this collective idea where uh, we, we established a company called Tibonas, which is now known as Tibonas Grill. So, to take a look at the kitchen, we have to go to the kitchen. We have to go to the kitchen, and 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 we have to go to the thing about us, Tibonas, in Kwamba, we make local gourmet barbecue. Okay, it's local in the sense that the price is uh, very reasonable, but the quality and standard are of like hotel like. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. So we started off with uh, the Nyamachoma Festival, and we had remarkable. Uh, I mean, like, uh, re remarkable results showed up because we were the victors of that competition. Uh, we came out first place because initially it used to be some kind of a competition rather than now people just go and barbecue. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So from there, uh, the second one was held in September, the okay. same year. And again, we secured the same place. Yeah. which was the first so that kind of like motiva uh, motivated us to, to continue that that business because we knew that it's something that we're good at kwa hiyo tukaendelea tuna kitu hicho hicho na kitu ambacho tulikifanya ni kwamba tuliboresha tu kitu ambacho tunakijua okay yeah na nyama choma the barbecue is that part of nani tanzanian culture yeah pretty much kwa sababu kiangalia hata Watu ambao wanasifika kwa kuchoma nyama watu ambao wanajulikana ni wachaga masai and uh, wachaga na, na masai ni watu wa Tanzania kwa hiyo watu wana hiyo desturi ya kuchoma nyama yeah. 